It's been a long time since I've been genuinely inspired and drawn in by a game. Valiant Hearts, The Great War, presents a story rarely seen in the art of video game making. I say art because this game on many levels is an artistic achievement. The story it presents is one of a kind, with depth and conflict. Along with the game's incredible art style, it only adds to the atmosphere. The game's mechanics are creative and beautifully crafted, to the point that they draw you into the game and don't leave you being taken aback or fumbling with the controller at any point. The game plays more like you're a character in an animated film. Nothing along the lines of a Disney picture or an FMV game like Dragon's Lair, but more along the lines of an animated art film. You know like the ones that get nominated for Oscars but no one's really seen them, but you really should watch them. But I don't think I can say enough about the art style in this game. For me, it draws you in at times, giving you almost August a claustrophobic first, feeling, and in others a giant scope in which to observe the massive game environment. Personally, it feels as if I'm watching something animated by Hao Miyazaki, because of the painstaking detail paid to every background in the game. The game wins my seal of approval because it not only lets you experience the First World War, but it does so in a very human manner. But it also has a factoid page where it allows the players to experience the game and learn about the actual events. I really love learning tools, camouflaged is something fun. It's a wonderful method of teaching. The game gives a more friend's perspective of the First World War, more than anything else. While watching the game, I am deeply drawn into the story, especially if you think about the historic conflict between the French and Germans that had been stewing for decades. For the French of 1914, the First World War was almost a matter of pride and patriotism that had to be taken to the field, as if the victory in this new conflict would regain their lost honor in the War of 1870. In 1870, many years before the First World War, France had fought and lost to the Prussians in the Franco-Prussian War. The conflict tore France apart, ending in a several-week civil war, with Paris actually becoming its own independent state for a brief period of time. That war changed how many thought conflicts would be waged. The American Civil War was what many thought war would be, a very bloody and industrialized affair with a high casualty number. The Franco-Prussian War was fought with such skill and precision by the Prussians that it left many thinking the Americans might just be amateurs in fighting wars. In reality, the Prussians just overwhelmed the French. The French suffered from a problem of having very skilled soldiers and not nearly enough of a big bureaucracy capable of waging a modern industrial war. The First World War would prove that numbers mean nothing in the face of machines designed to fire hundreds of rounds per minute. The French perspective isn't often shared with the rest of the world. In the United States, our perspective of the First World War is very distant and almost uninvolved. America's entry into the war was late in 1917, which made our experience of the conflict very narrow. The ocean that separated America and Europe made all those events seem very far away, despite the fact that the outcome would impact global events for decades after. Sorry for the off-topic shift. If I didn't talk about something history, I'd feel a bit weird. But I strongly suggest you pick up this title if you have a spare $15. It's been a long time since a game of this caliber has been produced. It's worth checking out just for the original story alone. The game's beautifully crafted art style mixed with the fun controls and game mechanics and puzzles gives you an almost fun, unique experience that I can only compare to that of watching some type of really fun art film that at no point are you drawn out of the story or unentertained with what's being presented to you. I actually like this game so much, I made this video a day after getting it and playing it. So if anything, I hope you'd take that as some type of good recommendation. Hope you have a wonderful day or evening. Thank you for watching.